Cornejo's staff, the Saturday starter for the Matadors. That one's tattooed to right field, well struck, and Swayka, all he can do is watch it go. The solo home run for Nolan Clifford. And the Blue Jays are a run closer, it's two to one CSUN. Second home run of the year for Nolan Clifford. Nice job of hitting by Clifford there as he worked the count full and kind of turned on it right in the wheelhouse and it leaves the yard over that right field fence. So the first hit of the game is a long ball and speaking of long ball, here's Jack Grace, the designated hitter, right-handed swinger. 217 on the year, 5 of 20 runner home. Happened yesterday, if you remember. Up the middle, base hit. Trotting home from third is North. Right behind him is Gobber. And it's a 4-2 Creighton lead. Clutch two-out RBI single for Andrew Meggs. So a four spot here in the top now of the second for the Blue Jays. So Meg's on first, here's Nolan Sailors. The center fielder, he flew to left his first time up. Take the extra base, they do all the fundamental things that a lot of the teams that we play do in the Big East, or, or the Big West. And a swing and a miss. Those pitches. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. Klein Sorge dials up the strikeout. And the match in Greenville, North Carolina. They took care of Georgetown out of the Big East yesterday, 18 to 3. And bunted right back to Klein Sorge. And Sakino can't get back. Double play. Second bunt that's been fielded by a Creighton pitcher. If you remember Grayson Marlowe yesterday. Andrew. Bunted and there was a nice diving play made by Ryan Windham. He didn't have to dive, but Klein Sorge, good reaction off the mound, and he doubles off to Huntington Beach Marina High by way of Cypress College. 0-2 pitch, chopper on the right side, comes up on a hop. Second for one goes Megs, the pivot by Clifford to first. Four to six to three double play, and that double play gets it done for Creighton. No runs, no hits, no errors, nobody left. Four innings complete, it's four to three hours on the afternoon. The righty sets, and here's the 3-2. Ground ball sharply on the right side. It'll get a run in right at Sakino. They'll get the second out. So for the first time in 10 years, they reached the semifinal in Class B that year. 0-2 pitch coming from Cody. Served into left field for a base hit, and the run comes home. Good bit of hitting by Nolan Sailors with the RBI. It's a one-run game. Gaber comes home from 2-1 pitch. Laced into left field for a base hit, a run's gonna score. Pits her into the corner, Canales around first, heading for second. In there, ahead of the tag. I made, Fitzer made that play a little bit closer than it should have been, but either way,